Hi, Lyle Stoneman for March 4th, 2012. I'm just gonna talk about my newest shoes that I got from uh, Fresh Air Experience here in Kelowna. Uh, I got Asics this time. I, last time I was using uh, Brooks, the Glycerin 9, which is a top of the line a running shoe for uh, 2011, I guess. I think they come up with a new one, a new model, maybe the Glycerin 10 for this year. But anyway, I got the Asics and they're a gel top of the line. I forget the actual model. But uh, I want to give a big kudos out to Fresh Air Experience and Valentina, the sales girl that helped me out. She helped me last fall when I got the Brooks as well. And I just, I really couldn't give the, give them higher props for uh, helping me with the shoes. <clears throat> I've been running now for a little over a year, year and three four months and uh, I bought some shoes at the big box store before and in the mall and you know, I was it was okay, but after dealing with with a more specialized store, it's I just can't say enough. Uh, you know, telling me what I should hear instead of what I was maybe expecting to hear or wanting to hear. And uh, anyway, the Brooks Glycerin Nine, they were just fabulous. I uh, wore them for five months. And uh, I keep track of all of my distance with uh, my Garmin uh, GPS watch. And even on days when I, on the treadmill, I'll manually enter the distance. Anyway, so I had 1,504 point something. Let's just call it 1,505 kilometers on the Brooks. Now, they were, if, uh, budget wasn't a concern I would have replaced them probably a month or two sooner uh, they were still good I think it's around eight nine hundred K but obviously at the end they were totally wore out all over I would wore right through the wear surface on the bottom and the top was breaking out and I you know I mean from a distance they look perfect but anyway they give a the gel padding had broken down and I was Every step I was feeling it a lot more and uh, I'm typically running at least 12k six days a week so I actually I've uh, the last nine weeks I've I've done 54 times I've done 10k or more and usually it's 12 to 13 14k I know I'm a little over I'm about 650k in in the Two months or nine weeks uh, so that's what I want to say get a good shoe both the shoes I got now and the one the Brooks I had were the top of the line in their brand uh, as far as just a straight running shoe they uh, there's trail runners and cross trainers and all kinds of stuff that I don't really I'm not really familiar with but uh, you know, I run primarily on the road on asphalt, maybe a little bit of concrete. And it's probably not much difference, but I tend to stick to the asphalt because I think it's a little more or less, a little less uh, impacting on the joints. And uh, and also, I got new socks when I bought the Brooks, and again another pair with the Asics. And uh, I was surprised how long the How long the socks last too? Like I, I mean, I wore them the whole time. The one pair I just washed them often, and uh, and they were well, they were threadbare too at the end. But uh, they the one I don't know the name of them offhand as I'm out here running. But actually, I I ran 12k today, and now I'm doing a kind of walk run for another six. I'll do kind of an 18. Today, kind of my long distance. Anyway, I've got some pictures I'm going to insert into this video that show some of the close-up of my worn-out shoes and the and new ones. Anyway, that's about all for now. 
again just the main thing I want to say if you're new to running get the best shoes you can buy at the very start I just I went to Zellers and Walmart and bought the 20 or 30 dollar shoes they're not worth taking out of the box compared to uh, name brand and well name brand is definitely good I'm not going to say there aren't some no name brands out like kind of a, a no name shoe that isn't good as well but if you buy something for 20 or 30 bucks you're better off to go barefoot I suppose no that's not probably the truth but these, these shoes I've currently got retailed at 190 the last ones I think were 179 the Brooks and uh, I, again I, I want to really thank Valentina or Val she uh, she recommended these ASICs because they were last year's model and they were soon to be going on sale so I'm sure she gave me uh, close to the sale price so I, I couldn't be any happier with the service that Fresh Air Experience and her Valentina's help, big help. If you're new to running, you need to deal with people that know. Anyway, over and out. Happy running.